their whole relationship, how much they just have always just, they light up the room when each other walks in and the way they just look at each other and just smile. I mean, you just see the love there and I've, I've just always seen it. <laughs> you look amazing. You excited? Yeah. I'm the luckiest girl in the world. <laughs> Even though she's my stepdaughter, I consider my own. Um, watched her grow up all these years and mature. You know, now she's getting married. And, just wishing the best. We're proud to have Zach. Yeah. I, I feel like he's one of mine. Yeah. Zach's only got to know three words for the rest of mm -hmm. his life. Summer, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> fixed a whole number made out of cabbage instead of lettuce. And he said, this looks awful flat. And I said, oh, it's fresh. And he ate, started eating his salad made out of cabbage instead of lettuce. Summer, she come up to the house one night. So when they all got out, I hit my truck horn like it was her car, turn around and start to go in. And I'd hit my truck horn again and they would think it was her car. I carried them on for about five minutes there. And uh, before they figured out it was me and my truck. So. We got one that can't figure out one vehicle if it's the horn blowing or not, and one that's eating a salad made out of cabbage. I think it's a marriage made in heaven, baby. To my husband, I have dreamed of this day since we were 13. I've imagined my dress, the venue, and the amazing men waiting for me at the altar, and you have surpassed even my best and most magical dreams. I promise to love you for who you are and who you will become. I promise to listen to you and to learn from you. I will support you and accept your support. I promise to nurture your dreams and help you reach them. You complete me in ways I've never knew possible. So I vow to inspire you, support you, and love you for as long as we both shall live. I promise today to be your best wife, your best friend, and partner and secret keeper that I can possibly be. I love you so much, yesterday, today, and for all of our tomorrows. Love, Mrs. Skips. <laughs> well, I thought they'd never make it to this stage. <laughs> They've been dating a long time, and we've been waiting on this day for a long time. I can give, and I'm a give, so I said, no, you ain't marrying no give. She's a gift. <laughs> Ask Zach to tell me three words that he would use to describe you. Zach described you as loving, passionate, and sane. As your sister, I can agree with him on all of those. You're loving to those who don't annoy you, and you're very passionate about the things you enjoy. At the end of the devotional, it had a space for you to write where your heart is scared from God. And so I wrote, God, you have given me the reassurance that I've been asking for because Zach is that person. He fulfills everything I need. Thank God for showing me what love is supposed to look like in this messy and complicated world and to not settle for anything less. I like to throw back to the times with all the truck rides to school and all the great music we listen to. All the fights. Yes, fights too, Zach. You remember those? You got me maybe once or twice, but that ceiling fan got you, bud. Uh, there's not much more I can say, really, though, but these two were made for each other, truly. And Mom will be so proud of you. I'm proud of you, and I got your back, man. All the way. I love y'all. Zach? Oh, Lord. 
<laughs> now, nah, well, he can't grow no more. So other than that, just take care of my little girl and we'll be good for the rest of their life. Pray together, love one another, and you will always be successful in your relationship. Zach, always remember Summer's right, too. No, I don't know about that. <laughs> <laughs> well wishes because I feel like they're both successful smart people and are going to do well. I feel like they'll figure it out and that they were going to be together forever. A vow is an important promise that you can make to one another. A vow is a lifelong commitment of devotion to each other. Isaac, take you, Summer, to be my wedded wife. I, Summer, take you, Zach, to be my wedded husband. Father, we thank you for these two that have come together this day to unite themselves in a relationship that you have established. It is my pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. Zach, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> I now present to you for the first time as husband and wife, Mr. and Mrs. Zach Gibbs. <laughs> Additional love and support to Zach, and he is so lucky to have this special dance with her tonight.
Artists. 